launched by the Otapi Town Council in 2012, the Olufuko Festival continues to grow by leaps and bounds. It has become one of the biggest cultural festivals in the country, attracting thousands of participants in various traditional, cultural and business activities. This is the pride of the people of the Omsati region and the Namibian nation at large. Omsati is the third biggest region in Namibia. It has four proclaimed towns, namely Okahau, Oshikuku, Ruakana and Otapi, who all participate in Olufuko. In addition, seven traditional authorities are the main pillars of Olufuko. These are Umbalantu, Ngulokadi, Onganjera, Umbanja, Ukwambi, Vita Tom Royal House of Kaukuland, and Oshikauko Traditional Authority. An ancient activity of the Oshuambo speaking communities, Olufuko, is a female initiation ceremony which girls between the ages of 15 and 20 undergo to guide them from childhood into womanhood. The ritual is performed by a woman called Namunganga and the process can last from five to seven days. All girls who are participating are expected to return to school and complete their education as the education of these girls is a top priority. In 2015, 103 girls from various regions of the country participated in the initiation process. Gloria Kandapo, an electrical engineering student in Cape Town, South Africa, was one of them. Okay. 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 Because I'm Africa. Oh, you're not a good girl. I'm not a good girl. I'm 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 a good the practice, which was abandoned for many years, was revived by the Otapi Town Council and endorsed by Namibia's former president, Dr. Sam Yoma, in 2012, who now serves as its patron. The festival has a preparatory committee. As, a, as the chairperson of the Olufuko Preparatory Committee, uh, our, aim, our big aim is to coordinate the event. We, when we're talking about the coordination of the event, is uh, to make sure that uh, the brides have a register uh, through their respective uh, traditional authorities. Yeah, before they didn't register, we normally have to remind also the traditional authorities, all of them, nine of them in the whole Ramsat region, as well as the local authorities within the Ramsat and the, the regional council itself. Uh, after the, they have registered, we have also to make sure that uh, the resident in the villages and in the towns are also informed to come and they will showcase their producers and also the, we have to invite the commercial or cooperate to take part in the event. Uh, the, 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 the big challenge is also, you know, the preparation of the, the gala dinner, because where you have to make sure 
at least you have uh, informed business people who can be able to support you and then uh, uh, the way how you, you inform them and the way how you talk to them is very very necessary and it's a challenging one so that you, you really make sure they have uh, given something for the event of the region. <laughs> Fuko takes pride in four main objectives that continue to shape the Namibian nation in various ways. These are to inform, educate, entertain, and enhance traditional and cultural identity. It preserves and promotes culture and tradition. It creates cultural tourism opportunities and strengthens the local and regional economies.
The duration of the festival is about 12 days and is divided into four categories. The first category being the girls' initiation ceremony. The second category is the exhibition of agricultural products. Arts and craft make up the third category, providing an opportunity to rural people to showcase their talents through exhibition and trading. The commercial products and services fall into the fourth category. These include both private and public institutions. Institutions such as the Electoral Commission of Namibia, the Ministry of Fisheries and Marine Resources, University of Namibia, Ministry of Education and Ministry of Agriculture are some of those that come to market their services at the festival. There are various activities that visitors can do while at Olofuko. One such activity is the visit to the famous Ombalantu Baobab Tree and Otapi War Museum that are just a 10-minute drive from the festival centre. This is the activity uh, um, done by the Pran Combatative Union uh, during the struggle. Um, as you see that all the pictures are here, um, uh, you find all the, the heroes and uh, our leaders. Uh, most of them, actually, they are, they are alive, they, they are still around, except Nakada and uh, Kita Naimba and others. <laughs> As the festival is growing year by year, organizers have developed a master plan for the center. The first phase will see the construction of a 400-bed hotel with conference center and the capacity to accommodate 2,000 people. The festival takes place at Olufuko Cultural Center at the town of Otapi in the Omusati region during the last week of August. <laughs> Various entertainment activities have been part of the festival since its inception. The highlight of the festival is the day of the official opening, which attracts national and regional leaders, captains of industries, and members of the diplomatic community. For more information on the Olufuko Festival, Take a look at our brochures, the Olufuko magazine and calendars or log on to www.otapitc.org.
www.org.na forward slash olufuko.html or call plus 264-6525-1191.